time for some random thoughts. Welcome, everybody. I'm thinking about what the world needs, what there's a lack of, and what would be easy to contribute for free. And I thought, well, <laughs> love and heart, soul, and depth. I feel like something about modern society, because you guys know I consider myself an old soul as far as I just really gravitate towards pretty much anything before the millennium change, 2000s. I'm, I'm a 20th century gal through and through. There just was more depth and soul, and you don't really find that much in modern media when you're going just out and about, the internet really makes things feel quite soulless. So I think that's something I want to strive to do is love on someone and to, to really own that soulfulness and let it shine through and not be ashamed of it. The fact that I'm very passionate about things. Um, so I was torn between talking about loving on someone today or how we need more depth and soul in this world more heart. Um, so I think I might combine those two. And when I say love on someone today, I, I was thinking about that too. It could be you. Maybe you need your love, time, care, attention. Maybe it's not another person. Maybe today's a day where you go, you know what? What would I give a best friend of mine or my best friend? What would I give her or him? And then give it to yourself, whatever you need. Um, if it's quiet time, if it's doing your favorite hobby, if it's being around people you love, maybe that fills your cup. But love on someone today. And if it's not you, love on someone. Find a neighbor, a friend, a random stranger, and it can be free. You can smile at them, you can wave. When I say love on, it doesn't have to be crazy. Tackle someone with a bear hug. Oh, I came both down here. Let me let her say hello because she is trying to say hello. Um, you can love on your pets. That's important too. Right, Capo? You want to say hi? <laughs> Look at this. She said, no, I don't. Um, love on your pets. Love on the earth. Um, but I just think it's so important if each one of us were to love on someone and or ourselves and the world and animals. Think of that ripple effect it could have. You might make some stranger's day by just holding the door open for them and smiling. Or um, if you can, maybe picking up their tab. Call an old friend. Maybe call a family member you haven't connected with in a while and just let them know you appreciate them. Maybe write someone a letter. I don't know. But it can be a myriad of things. and You can be as creative as you want. Uh, use your strengths, whatever that might be, to love on someone today. That's my challenge for the Rebecca Pebble viewer. If you decided to click on this, thank you for clicking on it. This is a quick one, but yeah, I just, I don't know something in my heart because that's how these videos come about. I'll just, something will pop into my spirit or download into my spirit as people say, since we use these technological terms these days to <sighs> define everything. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, at first I thought it was cool and I'm like, eh, now we sound like AI. But that's neither here nor there. I'm very pro-humanity, um, I believe in us. And so I, I just get these ideas, they come to me and I'll sit on them for a little bit and the ones that just, I can't quite, I don't wanna say get rid of, <laughs> that just kind of nag and weigh on me are the ones I end up making videos about. It's really an interesting process. It's like something's pushing me to tell you guys these things, so. I figure I'm just a conduit, a vessel for God to speak through, and so, or spirit, source, whatever you want to call it. Um, and this is the message, is love. I think now especially, I think if we can all just stay grounded, take deep breaths, so important, and remember our humanity and our empathy and our kindness, I think we'll be all right. I think we just got to focus on that and not get distracted by things that I don't know, people in higher positions of higher power than us, higher authority than us, I should say, because uh, we have power right inside of us. And a, a friend reminded me that the other day, we have an internal locus of control. So we do have control and we do have power. So it's kind of like shifting the focus away from that nonsense and saying, okay, power is within me to love someone today. 
So be brave, be bold, be fearless, especially in the pursuit of what lights up your soul, your spirit, and love on someone today. I love you guys. Have a good one. I'll see you next time.